feeling weird, coming back to work, I'm yeah. thinking, would it be okay if I wore leggings? <laughs> Maybe boots? Sure. <laughs> uh, out tonight at the uh, the concert at the mm -hmm. castle, and jackets were out there oh, for on a June up night. On the roof I mean, especially. There were folks who may not have quite prepared for it's the, the chill that was, that was out in there. a tent with uh, 400 the, or something. And the wind was blocked, so that part yeah. wasn't bad yeah. either. So, yeah, but a great time. And for all the folks who were out there, we were certainly saying hey to you all, and it was a great night. Let's go ahead and talk about this. We are talking about tomorrow. By the exile was out there tonight. The, you know, Central Kentucky zone, and the band has been together 55 years. Not all the same guys, but the band itself has continued that long. So pretty amazing stuff. Weather-wise, let's talk about our amazing weather. We could be headed to record territory tomorrow morning. The record's 47. That's what we're forecasting. Sunshine at lunchtime. Hey, that's a 20 degree some jump. Close to 70 at lunch. That's going to be terrific. Low 70s late in the day. We'll put a couple of decorator clouds out there for you. So tonight. We watch the sky clear out. Might be a little Virga showing up there out toward Rowan County. Uh, you see a little blip right there, but the air is really dry at the surface, so it's tough for anything to make it down. And tonight could be one to remember. And we'll talk about why in a sec. Going into the weekend, enjoy the sunshine tomorrow and going on into Saturday. And by Sunday, we have about a 15 degree jump from where we were today. So there is summer coming starting on Father's Day Sunday. Boy, there are a lot of rain chances coming in. By the way, how do you get a cold night to happen? Well, outside tonight we have a clear sky. The wind is light. The air is dry, so all the heat, we use that as a relative term, radiates on up towards space. So, okay, here you go. The sky's clear. If you've been outside, you can look up. Beautiful, big, waxing, gibbous moon out there. The dew point is only at 39. With the sky clear and the wind that is light, temperature starts falling toward that dew point number. And so it gives you an idea that we can indeed get toward record territory as that wind does continue to go down. So we are forecasting that low of 47. That would tie the record that dates back to 1933. We have a legitimate shot at it. We, and we could even get below that. It's possible. So again, yeah, it's uh, historic. You're talking mid 50s here at 11 o'clock. That is brisk including that 58 in Lexington, it's 59 over in Jackson. Normal highs running now into the mid 80s. OK, we were nowhere near that today, uh, but we do get close over the weekend. In fact, we may actually get to normal on Father's Day. But it's just this big, deep, cold trough that has plunged all the way to the Gulf Coast. Again, not a normal thing that happens this late in the season where you get cold air going down into the subtropics like that. Now, we are going to resume more of a normal zonal flow. That means temperatures are going to hang around the low 80s, depending on how much cloud cover on any given day. Uh, we'll see these storm systems pass by pretty regularly, and the bottom line is we are looking at a wet scenario. So tonight with the clear sky, that's high pressure passing right overhead, sliding off to the east tonight. By tomorrow, our winds begin to turn more southerly. That starts to bring the warm air back. Now, the warm front that you see there on Saturday does have some rain with it. I think that stays to our west until Saturday night. So your forecast for tonight. It's a clear sky, near record cold. There's that record of 47 from 33. 47 is what we're forecasting. Day tomorrow, lots of sun, but a seasonably cool day. Nice if it were May. We're in the low and mid 70s. Low 80s on Saturday. The day itself looks dry. Father's Day, not so much. Thunderstorms will be moving in. Those thunderstorm chances last well into next week.